Handmade Home, I'm Hester and today I'm having a co-star, meet Kermit the dog. For those of you familiar to my website, you might know Kermit because he's a little bit of a photo bomber and appears on loads of posts. As you can see, he's sporting a rather fetching bow tie. And today I'm going to show you how you can make one for your dog. What you need to make a bow tie? Fabric, bit of bias binding, needle and thread and some elastic. Cut the rectangle out of your fabric and fold the edges in. Fold your fabric in half and this is going to be your bow tie. Now sew these edges closed. Fast forward 10 minutes and I'll sew these edges together. I'm making quite a small bow tie because Kermit is a small dog. If your dog is bigger, of course, start with a bigger rectangle. Once you pleat this together, you can see it makes a really cute bow tie. Now get your bias binding. Measure the size of your dog's uh, neck. This is one I made before, so I'm just going to keep this measurement. You, apply, you do put a little bit of elastic in there as well, so it's easy to put over your dog's head. You don't want to make it too tight. And remember, this is only to be worn for a dog when you're around as well. It's not safe to have him walking around outdoors or on his own with a bow tie on, because you never know if you might get caught in something. It's just a bit of fun in the house when you're there. So I'm going to keep this measurement. Cut this to size. And you need a little bit as well for the middle of your bow tie. Get your small bit of elastic and sew it in the middle of your bias binding. So first we're going to attach the thread. I'm doing this with white thread so it's easy for you to see what I'm doing. Normally I would choose a thread that's more matching with the fabric I'm using. And you're just going to attach the elastic. Make sure it's nice and secure. And as you can hear from the triple triple, Kermit is coming over to see if his bow tie is ready. I've attached the elastics at both sides and now it's time to fold this over and sew the bits of bias binding together. And I think you can hear Kermit on the background asking if his bow tie is ready yet. So I'm just going to sew all the way around. So this is double. As you can see, I'm almost finished stitching these all the way around. I'm doing it in a white thread so it's easy for you to see. I would normally choose a green or a grey or something more similar to this colour. So, that's finished. And this is your colour. Now for the bow tie. You're going to plait it together in the middle like so. Get your bias binding and wrap it around. Make it nice and tight. And stitch it close. Now you have your bow tie, it's time to attach it to the bow. Find the middle, place your bow tie on top and stitch together. I've attached them both sides, one final stitch. And your doggy bow tie is done. I think we better find Kermit to see what he thinks of it. There you go, finished doggy bow tie. I think Kermit looks very handsome in it. Don't you think, Kermit? I think that's a yes. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. 
Remember, every Thursday, I'm making you a new craft video.